Let's talk about momentum and how important it actually is. Whether you realize it or not, at every point and stage of your life, you're carrying a certain amount of momentum and you have something going for you. Even if it might be negative momentum, it is momentum nonetheless. So you have to realize that you have to take control of it, make sure that it's positive, and make sure that it's helping you. This connects directly to positive upward spirals and negative downward spirals. Basically, if you are moving downwards, your momentum will come with you and push you even further down and things will become even more miserable. While on the other hand, if you're moving upwards and you're creating good results, you'll get your momentum coming with you and pushing you even further up and get even more results. So what you then have to realize is that you have to stay away from any activity that puts you in a downward spiral. Anything that moves you away from your goals, you have to quit it completely. And the reason for that is, it's obviously just as simple as that if you do something that takes you downwards, you'll build up momentum that takes you even further down and you'll be completely miserable. Well, on the other hand, if you get some awesome momentum, if you get some great results and you get yourself going upwards, you'll accomplish the most incredible things that you never thought were possible for you. And if you ever thought about it before, if you ever noticed before that sometimes you just hit such a powerful state of mind where you feel like you can accomplish anything, that is your momentum being leveraged so positively, so powerfully that you are moving in the right direction, getting the results that you want so easily and so swiftly without even trying. Because at a certain point, your momentum reaches some form of critical mass where it just bursts into overload and all of a sudden you're just crushing it completely and you can't understand what's going on. You have to realize that it is not by circumstance, luck or faith or karma. In a sense, it is some form of karma because you're creating results, you're earning your position and you're getting what you want. And the reality is that if you're going between the two, you're going to sometimes be miserable and sometimes be extremely happy. So it's these extreme mood swings and what you rather have, much rather, much better, much more pleasant experience is a gradual upwards, gradual growth. Not only is it much more fulfilling, but it's also much more peaceful to your mind that you don't go crazy and you're not looking around saying what's happening, is this God punishing me or the universe punishing me? Instead you're focused on your goals and you keep moving with consistency and that really is the key. So momentum can be built with massive consistency in the right direction. Look, if you're just starting out, you're not going to have a lot of good momentum going for you. In fact, if anything, you probably have some bad momentum going for you, dragging you downwards and what you then have to do is to reverse that and make sure that you start moving in the right direction, get the results that you want, build up some awesome momentum and start pushing yourself even more in the right direction.